ouch i literally just hit my foot walking over here and yeah that was not good okay all right i'm okay Ouch, ow. I should probably start the video now. Hey guys, it's Jesse V. So today I have a pretty funny story time for you. Okay, it's not necessarily funny. It's kind of funny to me and maybe to you guys, but definitely not funny to my mom or my dad for that matter. But I thought I would tell it today because I don't know, it's just interesting and so bizarre and weird. My mom has her own YouTube channel and she really wanted to tell this story on hers, but I'm beating her to it, okay mom? I'm telling it here. She might still tell it on hers, but I'm I'm first. And my foot still hurts. Ouch, that really, really hurt. The sound was so loud too. My poor foot. By the way, today I am not filming when I'm home alone, so you might hear stuff going on upstairs and it's not the ghost, I swear. It's just, I think Winnie's playing and my sister's walking around and my mom's watching TV, so you might hear weird background noises. It's okay. It's not the ghost. At least I don't think so. You never know. Anyway, speaking of like ghosts and creepy things like that, you guys got my last video to over 20,000 likes, which I knew you guys would do, okay? You guys are like magical. You're wizards. Go to Hogwarts, all right? Which means that I will be doing a haunted basement tour for you. I will probably put that up as my next video, actually. Yeah. Next video, haunted basement tour. And keep in mind, okay, my basement's messy. It's very, very, very messy. My mom actually might not be too happy that I'm putting a basement tour up because I don't think she wants anybody to see her basement. But, um, yeah. Sorry, mom. Okay, so this story time happened last week. My dad goes on business trips every once in a while, and when he goes, he's gone for like four or five days. So that leaves my mom and my sister and I alone in the house to kind of fend for ourselves, you know? So on Thursday night, it's about six o'clock, and I turn to my mom and I'm like, uh, it's dinner time. What are we gonna eat? We have to make something. And she looked back at me and she was like, I don't want to make something tonight. I'm just not in the mood to make food. So we all decided that we would order some food and usually our go-to order food is like pizza because pizza's the best. It's simple, it's quick, it gets here in less than 40 minutes. It's just easy, you know what I mean? But we just didn't feel like ordering pizza. We felt like pasta. Okay, so we decided to order Eastside Mario's, which I don't know if, I think that's just in Canada. I really have no idea. It's called an Italian restaurant, but I have friends who are Italian and they're like, no, that's a fake Italian restaurant. It's not a real Italian restaurant. So I don't really know what it is, but it makes good pasta. So we decided to order from there. So we placed the order. We're all super excited. I got my usual penne pasta with Alfredo sauce and shrimp because that's just, oh my goodness, that's magic in a bowl. My sister got spaghetti and my mom got, I don't know, penne with rosé sauce and shrimp, okay? It was like these three meals were just beautiful. Mm, beautiful. What was that? I just like totally took some of my lipstick off. So the thing with ordering from Eastside Mario's, and I'm gonna warn you guys, okay? If you have two hours to wait for food, great. Order Eastside Mario's. <laughs> but if you want it under two hours, um, it's not gonna happen, okay? Every time I've ordered from there, you're like waiting like decades <laughs> for your food. If you're hungry, that's it. You're dead. By the time it gets to the door, you're dead. You're gone, okay? Starvation has just kicked in. Your body could not take it anymore. You died. Yeah, so my mom and my sister and I were all sitting on the couch. We're just like sprawled out like, oh my gosh, food. Where is the food? And then finally, finally after waiting all this time, the beautiful sound of the doorbell, okay? The doorbell rings and we all get so excited. Our hearts are just filled with love because we know that the food's coming. So my mom gets up, she goes to the door. And of course, whenever we order something to the door, the dogs run and like attack the delivery man. Not attack, but like, you know how they like smell them and lick them and everything else. People don't like dogs. Some people just don't like dogs, especially delivery men. I've noticed that. So I'm over there helping my mom move the dogs out of the way and uh, she takes the pastas, puts them on the table, and then she goes to pay for them. You guys know the process, right? So she takes the debit machine, she pays for it, she thinks that all is good. She thinks that we were about to enjoy our beautiful pastas, but that was not the case at all. So I have a little hat here and I'm gonna reenact what happened, okay? So I am playing my mom and this hat is gonna be the delivery man, okay? Even though he wasn't wearing a hat like this, this is gonna differ different differentiate. I know how to say words. Just so you know what's going on, okay? Do I really have to describe this? I don't think so. <clears throat> so this is her. She has her debit machine, okay? She just paid and she's like, thank you very much, sir. Oh yes, no problem at all. I, oh. What? What's wrong? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. What happened? What's wrong? Oh, oh boy. Oh boy. What is it? Tell me what's wrong. What's going on? Oh, <laughs> what? What's happening? 
something is uh, very wrong here, miss. There's there's wrongness happening right now. Okay, tell me what, what happened. Did my credit card not go through? Like, what's happening? Did the payment not go through? Because I will pay again, all right? Oh, your payment went through. <laughs> Your payment definitely went through, miss. All right, so good. That's good. So have a good day then. Oh, no, no, no. You don't understand. You don't understand what you just did on this machine. So tell me. Tell me what I did. You, uh... <laughs> this is pretty funny, actually. You, uh, tipped me $300. Um, I'm sorry. Can you... <laughs> I don't think I heard you correctly, actually. Can you, um, tell me what? what? The, uh, the tip that you gave me on this machine, it's $300, 300 $300. That's funny because I thought you just said that I tipped you $300, but it was $3, right? That's what I heard, right? 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 Oh, miss, you wish it was $3. <laughs> you wish it was $3. It was $300, okay, bye. Have a good day, bye, miss, bye. Uh, hold, on, hold on, hold on, wait, 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 don't leave. Come here, what's, come here. Come back here, right now, stand here. Come here, give me the machine. Um, yeah, miss, there's actually nothing I can do about it, so I'm gonna go, have a great day, enjoy your pasta. Oh, no, no, you have to refund me for this. You can't, I'm not, <laughs> Eastside Mario's is not worth $300. I mean, the pastas are good, all right? The pastas are good, but they're not that good. They're not that good. Uh, yeah, there's just, there's no way to refund it on this machine, unfortunately. I can't do it. I can't do it. I don't know how to do it. So I'm gonna, you know what, um, call my boss, and, uh, I'm gonna go now, and we'll figure it out later. There's no such thing as later for $300, actually. Um, I need it back now, right now. I want it back in my credit card thing now. I want it in the card back, back in the, in the card. I want it in there in the card now. I would love to put it back in your card, all right, but I can't, so, um, peace. Peace be with you. I'm going. Bye. Goodbye. The, uh, he, he just took $300 from me. Jess? Jess, he did, got, get on the phone. Call the Eastside Mario's now. So, <laughs> my mom gets on the phone, and it's a very, uh, it must have been a very embarrassing situation for her, because she calls, and she's like, yeah, hi, um, so we just got our pasta, and it looks great, it looks wonderful, smells really great, um, but the delivery man, I just, um, I tipped him, I tipped him $300 by accident? Yeah, 300, yeah, that's what I said, I said $300? Yeah, three zero zero. That's what I tipped him, um, and I want that back because um, he's a great guy. He's a really great guy, but I, he wasn't that great. So, um, can I have my money back, please? They must have been like I couldn't hear the other person on the phone, but they must have been like. Um... Hold on a second, ma'am. Yeah, some weird lady just tipped a guy three hundred dollars, and she wants it back. Yeah, I know that's a lot of money, and we we should keep that money. You know what I mean? Because you know that's a lot of money. that's a lot of money. Um, no, but they they were actually pretty good about it, and uh, they said they would refund her. I think she's still waiting on that refund. It's been like a week, but they were really good about helping her and uh, dealing with the situation. So <laughs> I'm pretty sure my mom will get her money back. It was just a pretty funny story I thought to tell. That must have been like the best day of that delivery man's life. You know? And it was just, I guess it was just weird because he didn't really seem willing to help. Like, he didn't even stay there and, like, call his manager or, like, call the restaurant or anything. Like, he just wanted to get out. Like, he just took those that $300 and, like, left. He was good with that. But, uh, yeah, honestly, the restaurant did a good job of dealing with it. So, no hate to them. Still love their food. We'll still order from them, but we'll make sure. Maybe I should be, uh, paying for it next time, all right? Because, uh, my mom, my mom is very generous. But, yeah, I hope you guys did enjoy this story time. Just in case you didn't know, um, I am in a web series, I've been mentioning it quite a lot, but the first four episodes came out the other day, so if you want to see me act in these four episodes, I will put the YouTube channel down below. It's the Running with Violet YouTube channel, so yeah, you can check it out if you want, and I hope you guys have an awesome rest of your day, and until next time, bye!